Hello, elites, and welcome back to Minecraft the vs. Wild. Look inside my orange head. And today, what we're gonna, we're gonna do is we're gonna freaking build um, the uh, the, 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 the uh, flower, uh, gang hideout. My bad. <laughs> it's 151. That's what it is. I'm like lost on where I'm at right now. So yeah, this building has little broken ass windows, and it's just cute little store. This is the fireworks shop. Remember? Um, this is the fireworks shop that we built when I finished it off camera. I didn't do the top floors, but whatever, it's okay. So yeah, this how be dingy, stingy, ugly bitch, stingy bitch. That's what that building looks like. So the gang hideout's gonna be over here around the corner. Open up this little flap, go down. Ta-da! And we're gonna go this way. Down this ladder. Now this ladder right here, if you remember older episodes, it used to be like a little lava thing from the ceiling, and now it goes down. It used to be like a little secret passageway, um, for like, uh, like a cave of some sort, but now it's filled in, but there's a different point of entrance, that's cool. So we're gonna go down this hallway and we're gonna start building right here. Dun dun! So, oh my god, I'm imagining how I want this to go, but I don't know. This is gonna take forever, but I'm gonna chop away at this stone real big. So, <laughs> so the way I envision this, I've been thinking about it. Okay, first let's do like a, a dark road, a block of coal road, going all the way down here. And I'm gonna make it go diagonal all the way down, but sometimes it'll go flat, sometimes it'll stay, I don't know. It's a little bit different, like here. Um, go down one more, then we can go down one more, down to here. And then we could probably just make this go straight across here. Yeah, maybe one more. Um, since it kind of flattened out here, see it kind of flattened out and then it goes back straight down. Uh, so let's go across. So um, what I'm thinking for this place is like, um, if you remember me playing Saints Row 1, um, there was the old still water underneath the, uh, like the mission church place that we live in and it becomes like the new Saints hideout. This is kind of what it's basically what it's going to be based on kind of. It's going to be the same thing. It's going to be like an underground old city, but like, but like not like the hotel that they live in. When you walk out of that, and then it's just like all these homeless people homes and like stuff like that, where it's like old buildings and it looks like it got built over. That's what this is gonna look like. That's what we want it to look like. Because this was supposed to be a shelter to rescue and save people from something in the past, which now it's gonna be used for um, a gang hideout because it was abandoned and now it's being used again. Yay! So let's go ahead and do this. And I'm probably gonna cut this part out after I do the road. Um, because we're gonna start on the, like, little apartment building. I'm gonna be fixing a lot of stone, so it's gonna be chopped up a lot. Alrighty, and here we are. We are, uh, ooh, we popped through. Okay, well, we're gonna fill that back in, and what we're gonna do here, basically, is, um, we wanna push it up this, we wanna push the ceiling, the rock ceiling, up to where the highest point is, basically. We wanna make it look, um, we wanna make it look like, we want also want to make a lot of airspace for like buildings, so we're gonna build like cute little apartments that go up to the top, and then um, stores maybe and brothels and stuff like that. Cause it's a gang hideout. We gotta have all that kind of stuff. Maybe like a hangout place for them to like do like poker, like some kind of like gambling, just fun stuff like that for them. Um, so we're gonna tear this away. I'm gonna leave the the glowstone blocks because I want to see. And look, there's a building above us, which I think this is the factory. Yeah, the factory building, and, uh, that's cool. So I can't wait to build this first apartment building here. So that's, we're just, that's how high we want the ceiling. All the way down to the end. Um, even if it goes far down there, it's still gonna go way high up here. Because we want it to be like that, as if, like, you know, this part of the city fell, and, you know, oh no, you know, it used to be a hillside. So the hillside is still gonna be really, uh, relevant in this area. It's still gonna show. So... Because when Dr. Crimson did attack the city, there was a, um, like, earthquake of sorts because of his, uh, big tornado blaster things, uh, took it down, basically. Ooh, more light. Oh, yeah, because this is going to cut into caves. There was caves under this, um, this freaking factor. I know that for a fact. So, we're going to be cutting into caves a little bit, but that's okay. They're going to disappear because they're going to become parts of buildings or become just airspace for this. And, um... Buildings are mostly going to be the uh, support beams for the city. And we're also going to have, if it's like an open space, like a park that was um, above ground once, that's going to have like a column here and there supporting it, just so that way that looks really cool. Uh, we're not going to make everything very futuristic down here because, well, 
it should look old. It should look like examples would be like old Stillwater in uh, Saints Row One, and then also um, old New York in Futurama, where they have like you know they basically just paved over it, and it's like all the old buildings. It's like in the sewers and stuff. So when you when you go to the sewers of the city, I haven't built a lot of sewers of the city, but um, I don't think we're gonna do that because there's a lot of just imagine that there's pipes going through the walls and stuff like that. <laughs> uh, I'm going to go ahead and cut part here, and uh, we're going to start the apartment soon. And we are back, and I carved out this area here, so you can kind of see how the buildings are going to go down, where it's like, that's going to be on its own support beam, and it's going to follow that rule kind of all the way down. So the buildings will get taller as the road goes down, which is cool, you know? And uh, there'll be cool little nudges and spaces in between buildings, alleyways that used to be. And uh, what I'm thinking of is, like, um, when you go inside buildings, there's going to be some doorways. Like, oh, look, a door. Open it up, and it's like, oh, cobblestone, what the hell? Because it's caved in on that part. Some parts will be caved in, some parts will be destroyed, some parts will be old, some parts will be nice, still, somehow. So, you know, let's say, because uh, it's 2087 in our world now, let's say this fell underground uh, when Dr. Crimson attacked the city back in, like, um, freaking... I don't know, 1799 or something like that. Um, something like that. So let's put a button here at the top of the door so we have a way in. Um, because the gangs don't have to worry about, like, you know, there you go, they can walk out whenever they want. And I do not like this hallway. It's kind of short, guys. I don't like it. I have to, uh, for now we'll just put the golden trap, the golden, uh, pressure plate because <laughs> it's annoying. So let's go ahead and start with this apartment thing. So... Um, let's do old, we gotta do old-fashioned blocks. So I used to build with a lot of, um, stone brick. So that's what we're gonna do. Um, uh, we're gonna build with a lot of the materials that I built with when I first started the city, so. We're gonna actually move this back two more, because I'm imagining, like, a little patio front. A little patio with, like, maybe one chair up front. Um, you know, that's what I'm imagining. And we'll do this here. And we're going to do, like, a uh, cobblestone, like, uh, patio deck area right there. And we're going to make it go straight across um, to the end of, like, where the stairs stop going, uh, where they stop declining right here. And then, um, yeah, we'll change that up. Um, or maybe we can make some of it mossy. I wish they had, like, cracked cobblestone, but you can't really see that because the cobblestone blocks are so small. Okay, and uh, fill this in, and then, um, oh, I'm imagining, what is this apartment, apartment, this isn't even an apartment, by the way, this first building here, on the left, I'm um, imagining, like, a cute little, like, maybe, I think it's gonna be, like, two stories, maybe, <laughs> I'm not sure how tall it's gonna be, because this area is really short right here, so let's do, a, do okay, 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 I'm gonna build like I did, uh, my old-fashioned buildings when I, when my city didn't get destroyed, and it was, like, all old-fashioned, like, three-story buildings, four-story buildings. And, um, it was just that cor tiny little corner. I used to have, like, big windows like that on stores and stuff like that. And, oh, my God, I can't wait till this looks just like something I built. It's like, oh, no, it fell under. It's like, wow, look at this history. It's kind of like the lost city. The lost part of the city. Because <laughs> the city is too big now. So, it's like, what part did you lose? Because <laughs> there's, like, a hundred parts. I'll be right back when I finish, um... Figuring out how I want the design of this damn apartment. Okay, and uh, this whole building is done. I just uh, need to do the glass on the top. Uh, this doesn't really need torches. It's pretty lit up because of the glowstone that was here before. So that's pretty cool. Let's go like this. Uh, fill this, and it has to be brown windows because it has to be dirty, like old and dirty. So <coughs> there's that. Uh, <laughs> my sneeze. <laughs> I'm going to go down. So it's about like two and a half floors. It's going to be really small on the top, but that's okay. It's like a little attic. And, you know, maybe a piece of the building was still above ground a little bit because it was kind of like a tall one. So they, like, flattened that part out. And like, oh, crap. Maybe we could just, uh, maybe we could just make that uh, still a room. But, like, a tiny little room. There we go. Um. Ye. Yeah. So... Now let's focus on the outside a little bit, because it's kind of dark out here, but I also want, like, a fence, so you don't fall right off this little, like, um, stone ledge thing. Like, I want this place to look like Colfax, <laughs> um, in Colorado, when you go near downtown, like, just bad, just, just ew. Like, why? <laughs> so, 
this, and then... So we're gonna make all the blocks mossy. Most people will probably be like, well, why don't you make some of them mossy here and there? I'm like, yeah, but, um, you understand this is gonna be 300 years old, so... And it's gonna be 400 soon, so... It has to be like this. Let's see. Um... There we go. Go up like that. Uh... Now, we gotta figure out how to do with this wall. Let's see, this wall we should just grab... What do we want this wall to... I wanted stone, but I was like, no, that's just gonna be like a cave. I don't want it to look like a cave. I want it to look like maybe uh, it was a cave wall before, but they were like, you know what? Uh, since it fell and we're kind of rebuilding a little bit of it, let's uh, let's fill it in with some stone to make it a little sturdier and not cave in all the way. Um, just so that the city above is supported because this, this infrastructure down here. So we'll make walls like this, but they're gonna be all dirty and rusty, crusty looking, so that's why we're using crack stone brick, because crack stone brick doesn't look cracked in this dash map, which I kind of like. I like it, it looks like dirty. It's like dirty, there's like dingy, and there's like moldy, so that's good. That's the difference. Uh, it looks cute, it's cute, you know? And we'll have another one right next to it, uh, butted up against it, butted up against it, and it's going to go taller, and it's going to have a different entrance way down there. Um, I can't wait. This is going to be so cool. And then we can make a basement inside this stone area here. Um, it won't have any windows, which will be weird, but eh, fuck it. So we'll do a little fence there. And let's see. We don't need a fence post there because we'll walk in through here. And you know, you can just sit here and watch people walk by, you know, smoke cigarettes, whatever. <laughs> Mob people do this too. Um, let's go ahead and get rid of these floating ones because I don't think they're really lighting up anything anymore. Everything's kind of getting built up, so there you go. Anyways, guys, that's it for this episode. Leave a like if you enjoyed. I hope you did. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. Tell someone about the channel. I'll see you in the next video that I create. It's been fun building this cute little building here. And so, goodbye, elites. Goodbye.